18, 19, 20. Because I have to get buffed somehow. <laughs> so many cams, what the fuck? Whoa, you need a hype button? <laughs> hype! Refresh. I have something for you. I have a little note for you. Let me just let me just grab this baby. <laughs> Fuck off, fart poop gay gay. Just kidding, man. I just had, I wanted a reason to pull that out, that's all. Source button! That's exciting. Why do I get a source button if they can't afford the resources to partner me? I don't understand. It makes no sense. Show me the finger. <laughs> Thank you. It's a wig. Wig out Wednesday. Thank you. I'm gonna refresh. Today's the last day for the t-shirt voting. So do you guys wanna see what I made already? I made this already. I'm working on finishing some details. And then I, I ordered some um, of this epoxy stuff that will make it so that it's nice and smooth texture and then I'm gonna paint it all and it's gonna have like this is actually gonna be like spider webbing like this all over what do you do this is what I do <laughs> and this is from start to finish the process of making the armor so we made that chest piece the same way you wrap your arm in cellophane you tape yourself you draw the pattern that you want you cut out the pattern that you want you transfer the pattern to the foam then once you cut the foam out, you cut out the warbler, then we're going to take this heat gun and while we're going to um, have it, like, I'm going to heat it up and then we're going to shape it to my arm and glue the, we're going to glue the foam to it first, actually, and then we're going to shape it. <laughs> so, let me trace this. This looks like a butt, does it not? This looks like I'm making a butt out of war blood. <laughs> I don't need that. I got a booty. Okay, so let me trace this. Oh, you know what? That's a that's a good angle. Let's just leave that. Oh, you know what? I was gonna watch that video. Hold on, let me watch that video. Which reminds me, you guys need to send me your reaction videos during the week so that on Wednesdays when you come into the channel I can pull up the video you want me to watch on stream and um, while you're in the channel so you can see my reaction but it can't be bloody or gory or anything that's gonna get my twitch banned or anything like that that's why I ask you to send me them before the stream so I can kind of like make sure they're not gonna be terrible <laughs> some weird looking boobs ah <laughs> my booty. Shh. Shut, shut up. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, so I have the link saved already, crew, for the video that you wanted me to watch. This is the video I am pulling up right now. If you guys all want to pull it up and watch it with me, this is the one that crew sent me. Another video that reminds you of the Mugen Scheiser. Well, you know what to do. Message me that and I'll watch it next week. Oh, let's. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Wait, I gotta pause this song. Hold on. Okay. This is called Assassin's Ki Kitty Kitten's Unity. I swear I've seen this before. I think I've seen it. Where did I see it? I can't actually pull up the video on my stream because I think it's against Twitch policy, but you guys can all pull it up on your end and we can kind of watch it together. Maybe eventually we can pull it up on stream and I'll watch it, but... Oh, yes! I've seen this one with the kitty! I love how, but they're like getting thrown. They're like being thrown. It's funny. Didn't I watch this one last week? 
This might be the same one that I watched already. But it has been trending. This video has been trending around. Oh no, Sky! <laughs> okay, see you later. That happens. That's another reason why I can't have nice things. Girls be getting jealous! They don't need to be jealous. I'm like married and I'm totally cool. I'm not gonna go for your man and hopefully your man just thinks I'm cool and he doesn't want to like do you or something, you know, like fuck up anything because of me. That's just stupid. They should be more confident in themselves. I thought you sent me a different one. <laughs> oh well. What the hell? Let's get... Wait. What was that noise? What did I do? Oh, I accidentally started that song. I need to actually make some requests of my own here. Let's do that. And I found this... Ooh! Crew, I found this playlist that I think you will like! Um... I'm gonna I gotta have more cowbell! Babe. Thank you for that follow, Restalmelin! I'm gonna request this song for Crew because this one reminds me of you, Crew, and I found this playlist that I was like, you're really gonna like this. This one's the best one off of it, even though we heard it earlier, I don't think anyone's gonna notice. And then... We have the other one that's, um... This bass nectar bass head song that I don't know if you got to hear earlier either that I liked. Okay. Isn't that cute? It's not my kitty, I wish. My cat's pretty damn cute though. She's pretty damn cute. Okay, let me finish tracing this so I can get it cut out. I'm actually gonna, oh, I need to turn on my electric knife. This knife gets up to 750 degrees. So we're gonna have to turn it on. It takes about 10 minutes to warm up, so I think that'll be enough time for me to trace this play point game, perhaps. And then we can cut out the shape of the bracer, the arm bracer. Come with me. You're going to the Great Escape? Where is that? Yeah, it did. Cats are cute. I could watch cat videos all day, and that's why if you guys come across some cute cat videos or animal videos or anything like that, you can send them to me and I'll watch them on stream on Wednesdays, and you can see my reaction and stuff. We already did the ones from earlier um, when Madden and everybody was here. I had some for Madden and Jason. Whoa, that was super loud right there for a second. Sorry, guys. Also, this warbler needs to be cut out just a tiny bit lar larger than the foam as well. Or maybe I need to cut the foam down just a little bit once I've got it. Yeah, I probably should do it that way. I hope the power doesn't go out again. The lights are kind of flickering. We already had the power outage earlier. Your kitty just came up to you, cute. I am wearing Planetronics uh, wireless headset that I blinged out. I put some bling bling on it. Cute, I'm on here. Drums just exploded. <laughs> nice.
Yeah, dubstep's good. I mean, that's what we li or listen to pretty much on Wednesdays. Tim Hugenscheiser was here earlier, but she's sleeping. She George came home a little bit earlier because he had a doctor's appointment and had lunch and got her pets, and now she's in bed again. <laughs> Let me just cut this down a little bit smaller. taken away that I can have some space there. The warbler does stretch a little bit, so... Suitable times when you're awake and you're asleep. Um, eight hours earlier than whatever time it is where you are. Because the... just remember, minus eight hours. Just about. Pretty sure it's about eight hours. <laughs> Get your browsers ready to be or refresh your browser so you're ready for the point game. Because I'm going to be doing the point game after I get this cut out. And before we cut out the warbler. Okay, Although I can smell this knife already heated up. It's very hot. Me too. Point game time. All right. Foam and like scraps of warbler everywhere, all over the place. <laughs> okay, let's see. Are you guys ready? Oh, wait. I'm gonna do uh, the rolls for the the free points first. Good luck everybody! You must be following the channel at the time the dice is rolled in order to win the points for lurking and the points go towards free drawings and things for me, name commands, all of that. Night shift! Oh my god. It's, it's, you've won a lot, but you haven't actually won in a while, believe it or not. Like the last time you won the dice roll. Oh, I guess you did win it for the card game. <laughs> I guess it does really like you. It really likes you. And here we go again. Mike! Yay! Just in time to say rigged. <laughs> Good job, Mike. 
Get your typing fingers ready! What's up, beast? Name a place you see an antenna! Scotty's the first one showing up on the list to say room. Guess what? Oh my god. I got a fever. And the only prescription is more cowbell. Oh my god, more cowbell from Fatboy Slim. Never give up, never surrender. Five dollars. Thank you so much. That that counts as a sub. Like, I don't need a sub button. You just subbed to me. And I got all five dollars of it. Yay! <laughs> Thank you so much. And I'll be doing those lists here in a second after we finish this point game. So Scotty, you got the number one answer with 31 points! Radio Station! Lee Cap K for two points! Woo! And Car! For the number three answer, Damon Blight picks that up for 24 points! Damon Blight! Whoop, whoop, whoop. I love you guys. Thanks for playing the point game with me. And roof. Oh, that's a. Oh, we already saw that. <laughs> We're looking for radio tower. Astrin. Five points goes to you for that one. And television set. My God. Woo. Coming in with a number four answer. I gotta have more cowbell, baby. Oh, actually, you know what? You said the number two answer first. Captain Jack Swagger, thank you so much for following. You said house first. Mike said house first, and that is the number two answer for 28 points. Good job, Mike. See? Remember this time. Remember this time the next time you don't get points. You got points. You got the number two answer. Okay? <laughs> and then we have... One, we're missing one more because you guys are OP. One more. And it's already been said. TV! Night Shift! For six points. And I'm also going to give it to... Battlefish! You guys both kind of said it at the same time there. Battlefish! Six points goes to you for the answer. And thank you so much for playing and being here. I appreciate it. For escape, so that's six points for television. Thank you guys for playing the point game with me. Let's also do the card game. It didn't go so well earlier. I'd like to kind of redeem myself with the whole card game situation. Um, <laughs> so these are the cards that have already been chosen. We've already taken out all, every card, but the only thing left are face value cards. These face value cards have already been chosen. Please do not choose from these three cards. Choose any other card. You must be following the channel at the time the dice is rolled. If you pick the card that I choose from the deck, you will be able to choose a prize from the prize closet. And if you do not pick the correct card, you will get the extra 10 points just for participating and for being here. Good luck, Apple and Pear. Let me know what card you want and where you want me to pick it from. And if you get the right card, you get to choose a prize from the prize closet, which I think you'll like some stuff that's in there. I think you'll really like it. Radio was on there, but it was said before you were able to type it into the channel. And I go by whoever said radio first. And it was um, Lee Cam K. And then Astron said radio. Tawa. We're only doing like kings, queens, ace, or jack. So it has to be, you have to pick from those face cards. I guess people don't know what face cards are, so I'll explain king, queen, ace, and jack only. Don't pick out of these three cards either. These have already been chosen. Any of the other ones? Only Apple and Pear can pick because he was the one that was rolled for the dice. <laughs> does that make sense? I hope that does. K 
King of Diamond, and you wanted me to pull it from where? Top, middle, or bottom? There is a top, middle, or bottom to the deck, believe it or not, even though there's not that many cards in here. <laughs> From the bottom. Okay, King of Diamond from the bottom. Let's see. I'm gonna go from the very bottom, because you said bottom. Oh, it's the Queen of Clubs! The Queen of Clubs has been removed from the deck. Make sure you guys write down which ones have been removed from the deck, so that you don't pick the same ones. But you get the 10 points just for playing, so congratulations Apple and Pear, that'll get you 10 points closer to whatever you're saving your points for, because there's a lot of things to save points for at this point. And we already did have a winner for the card game. They are going to win the hand box. That's Wick Kid who won the box, handmade box for me that I'll be mailing over to him. Congratulations. Cheers. Thank you. King of Middle Earth. <laughs> You're funny. Okay, so this is going to be hot enough now. I should probably. Have I gotta have more cowbells, baby. Oh yay, Michael! Thank you for following, man. A follow, yay! Appreciate that. I'm going to move these over here. And I'm going to put up my chest piece so you can see that while I'm working on the other pieces here. Name command. That's cute. <laughs> you can like see all the stuff that we just linked in um, Goodnight Reaper linked in the channel. I had to make a command for the list of stuff that you can get for your points because there were so many things that I have to offer. So, like, I'll just show you an example of the drawing. Like, you can tell me what subject you want me to draw you. This is the drawing of the Teddy Roosevelt that I drew for Como Freak for his points. And this is a copy of the Catwoman I drew for Viper Mark 21. So if you told me what character you want me to draw for you, I would draw it for you. Every character you add to the drawing, though, is more points, just because I gotta keep it within reason. So. <laughs> Clouds Guy, yeah, you can get points. Actually, you get a lot of points for a lot of reasons here in the channel. I give out stuff as much as I can. Yeah. I didn't do the Fat Boy Slim reps, no. Um, <laughs> but thank you for reminding me. So you can get one point for every 60 minutes you're in the channel, whether I'm streaming or not. We also play the point game twice per day. And you, as you can see, people earn various amount of points depending on what questions they answered and what order they answered them in. You also get points for the dice rolls that we do in the channel as well, so we can um, roll the dice. And if you're lurking in the channel, whether you're active in the channel or not, as long as you followed, Nightbot can roll your name for extra points that way too, so you don't have to actively participate in the point game, you can still just get points for being here. So, yay! Thank you! The point game is twice per day. That's why some people are able to win over 100 points in one day. Let's do some lifts now. Let's do some lifts. I got these new five pound weights, guys. Five pound weights. I upgraded from the three pound to the five pound. Way hard. Whew. I need to like 
cool. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Pump it! Pump it up! I need to. Because, like, Night Shift even made fun of me and, like, was like, You can't even tell you've been lifting anything! Like a penis, he has to make fun of me. No, no. <laughs> I'm like, damn it! I have been! I have been working on that shit. You should Skype? Uh uh. I thought that was. I thought it would be funny, but now I'm like, uh uh. I can't do it, because then people would want to Skype with me all the time, and I don't have time for Skype. I barely have time to do anything. I don't even have time for myself. All my time is dedicated to the stream. I don't even like. <laughs> Like, try to relax or, like, do anything nice for myself. My back's k killing me all the time. Like, I do as much as I possibly can already. Oh, you know what? This isn't on. This is off this whole time. I thought it was heating up. Damn it! <laughs> now what am I gonna do? I gotta wait for this to heat up more. Set her down here. There we go. You guys want to see the snake whip I made already? This is for this cosplay too, so it goes with it. I made these snakes out of craft foam and um, an old lamp that I had. It is 3:41, so I painted them all. We have, I'll show you, while well, I'm waiting for that to heat up, the, we have the King Cobra, the black King Cobra, it's all hand painted on, 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 the, the, on the underbelly and everything. Then we have the regular King Cobra, with all the stripes that I had to hand paint on everything, on him. Then we have the Black Mamba. that I hand painted. This one's pretty cool. With all that detail. And then we have the blue crate, or the blue viper. This is the blue viper right here. And then we have the blue crate snake here. This one with the blue stripes on it. This was all craft foam, an old lamp, and some hot glue, and um, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Dark Joker. This is my drow snake whip. Thank you. Viper was here earlier. He's still at work, though. He's going to try to come in later on. These are going to be my little drow bottles that are, I'm going to be on my hip. Let me see, this is a loud fucking song. Oh, I can't turn it down. Um, that'll be on my belt. It's gonna go right here. Thank you. And then also I'm gonna put some detail on the back here. I might have to put some, I'm gonna probably put some foam behind this so I can shape it better as well. This song really caught me off guard, me too. Dark Joker, I'm working on the Dark Elf cosplay for the Salt Lake City Comic Con in September. It's gonna be like September 25th that I'm doing this cosplay, so. I still have a cloak with fairy fire that I need to make here and fashion the lights inside of the lining and it's going to go around my head of the hood and then the front of the cloak. I still need to work on the, the bracer that I'm making now. I need to finish this. I need to fix the boots that I'm um, going to have for the drow as well. So I still have a lot of work to do. I don't, I am making black ears as well, black elf ears. I don't know what I'm going to do for Tuesday's cosplay, but you guys voted. Um, we had that straw poll out last week on what cosplay you wanted me to do on Tuesday, which was Black Widow. 
And whatever else was on that list, I'll probably do next. So you can see those other cosplays that were on the list. Um, at Cheryl, that Ash vs. Evil Dead is a TV series, not a movie. Oh, I know. October 31st, like a mini series. I know, what happened to FantasyCon? Well, FantasyCon was canceled this year. They are going to have it next year. They said that they were out of funding and stuff and they needed, like, um, a break. Okay, good night, hey, Breeder. Can't wait to see you on Metal Monday. Hope you have fun at your concert. Sleep well, dear. We will miss you, darling. Thank you, Dark Joker. Have a good time at the, the festival and don't participate in that death walk. Don't do it. Crew's really upset. He's gonna miss the hell out of you, I can tell. Look at him. That's very sad. <laughs> Anytime we have some downtime. What else I've been working on is this. We can work some more on this. This is the lining that's gonna go on the side of the skirt to cover my, my booty shorts. And the fabric was white before, but to make it more drow and to make it darker, because they're all about stealth, I've been drawing with this fabric marker um, over the white lines to make it still look spider webby, you know. Bromance <laughs> temporarily bro broken. Yeah, think of me. <laughs> Cute. Welcome back, Como Freak. Yeah, I have a beer or two. for crew and for all the psychos and you be safe you remember my face you be safe hey breeder you don't go into that death wall <laughs> oh that's cool um, um hey that's awesome she pretty fr huh it's this way Okay. Remember my face. <laughs> I gotta have more cowbell, baby. X Picky, thank you so much for following. No, the death wall is like scary, and I don't want to imagine the hate breeder. I gotta have more cowbell involved in the death wall of any kind. Usher, uh, thank you for following. We had a follow train of two people just now. That's amazing. Wow. Yay! Thanks for following on a creative stream day. Usually get unfollows, so we need those follows to balance things out a little bit better. Oh, for real? <laughs> Aww. Okay, Cass, that's funny. Feeling the love. You just barely noticed the free candy truck? Yes, Skillet's awesome, Battlefish. Do exclamation candy pan. <laughs> it has its own command in the channel. It's a very important asset for when we're streaming Grand Theft Auto that we have the candy van in the corner. Believe me, it comes very in handy. And for those of you who didn't know, we were denied partnership for the fifth time yesterday, but we're not going to let it bother us. We're just going to keep going and doing our thing, and I just think that they are treating us a little unfair, but whatever. As long as I have your support, I'll be really happy to continue streaming for you guys. Just hang out on the channel and be here so that I know that I have your support, and that'll make me want to keep going no matter what. Where did my lid go?
Oh, I dropped it. Aunt Sharon. Headpiece? What headpiece? Oh, the other camera? I called her Aunt Cheryl. <laughs> uh-uh. I was. I don't have enough people in my channel, I'm sure. That's always the, what they say. Let's see, so... I'm, I am definitely anti Cheryl. I've always been anti Cheryl. Okay, so now we're gonna cut this. Doing well. My brothers and sisters are all doing good. I did Black Cat the week before last, and the week before that, I did Catwoman. <laughs> Dark Joker. So you can add Instagram to see those pictures if you want, but I can't do those too close to each other. <laughs> Thank you guys for being here. I appreciate it. Let's see if this is going to work now. It's still not hot enough. Is it even heating up? Feels like it. Hmm. Oh, it's unplugged. Damn it. I really need to work on this, but I keep fucking up. We'll just paint on some of this. Technical difficulties. It's not even plugged in. Um, it depends on the costume, but this one will probably take the longest that I've ever worked on anything before. And it's for a group of three of us that are going to be together, so I really want to make it look good and put some time into it. Loving the hair. Oh, good. <laughs> the green and black will be for She-Hulk, for sure. My werewolf one. I already know what cosplay I'm going to do on Tuesday, you guys, so... <laughs> Thank you, Night Shift. My siblings are not gonna stream with me, no. <laughs> Aww. Auntie Cheryl. Oh my god, you guys. Do you know I've been an aunt since I was like eight? Oh shit. This is not a very good setup, but I have to like be able to show you guys what I'm doing. And so everything is just really scatty wampus. Ugh, I'm really sorry. You mean you're putting effort to sh show the others up? What? I'm not trying to show them up, actually, Astrid. That was kind of an asshole thing to say. I um, am the, they want to make me like the high priestess, so they're expecting me to put forth a better cosplay is all. They made it sound like so fucking weird. Bye, Dark Joker! Oh, I don't hate you. I mean, you've made fun of my arms, and now this whole thing happened, and it's fine. Just make fun of me, it's okay. Call me Auntie Cheryl, call me whatever you want, I don't care. Grandma, call me mom, old lady, whatever you want. <laughs> make fun of my arms, make fun of my face, make fun of my hair, make fun of my hands, make fun of my body, make fun of my outfit, make fun of my chest, make fun of whatever you want. <laughs> That's why I'm here. Take out all your aggression on me. It's all good. <laughs> Everyone makes fun of me. Viper, who doesn't make fun of me? 
<laughs> I need like 500 people here in the channel for them to partner me. That's what they said. They keep saying, 500 people, 500 people. Well, I'll never have 500 people, so let's just forget about that whole thing. It ain't gonna happen. It ain't gonna happen. I gotta have more cowbell. Baby. Royalty, thank you so much for following. <laughs> Loads AK. You said it didn't look like I'd been lifting at all. And Astrid made me sound like I was a stuck up bitch. <laughs> and now I like, I don't know. It's just funny. You can think and say whatever you want though, because I'm so used to like being made fun of at this point. I had a 32 ounce drink chucked at my head before for being a freak, so. It's not like it's like my first rodeo and having people say whatever they want, you know? And me just sit there and be like, oh, okay. You can tear me apart. <laughs> I'm used to it. Comment on everything. Everybody. Big hugs. And loves. You know I'm fucking with you too, though. I gotta fuck with you back a little bit if you're gonna tease me constantly. I mean, come on. <laughs> I gotta have more cowbell, baby. Ease, thanks for following. And you guys are all sweethearts, you know. The things that you say to me are not abusive, and they are not hateful, and they are not threatening. And I really appreciate that because you know what happens if they are those things. You get sent to the candy van. <laughs> Dallas, what's up? Lots of love, Dallas. How was your day? And lots of love, Mike. It's cool. <laughs> you can tease me. No, she's agreeing, like saying, uh, you know, 23 should be enough. I've seen a lot of people with le way less, but it's the viewers. I can't seem to get people to just leave the browser to the channel open. They always have to leave. They always have to go somewhere and be somewhere else and just close the channel when they could easily just leave the channel open, pause, mute, minimize the stream, go about their day and still support the channel if they really believe that we deserve the partnership at this point. So I'm just kind of like at the resolve of, I don't think anyone, not enough people are gonna keep the channel open to make that happen. So we just need to let it go. Twitch hates me, so. The 500 viewers, exactly. <laughs> no, you're not chopped up liver. What are you talking about, Willis? I just stay in two decks. I bet you're sore and probably sunburned, aren't you? Yeah, it's okay. Don't even worry about it. Just don't like, attack other people in the channel or like get after them if they say anything because it's all good. Lots of love, positivity. I do. I mean, I sit here and take it every day for two years. I've taken it my whole life, Cloud Sky. I have the biggest backbone that you will ever meet in your entire life. I've had death threats, rape threats, fucking people telling me I look like I'm pre-op, of a ma I'm still a man, blah, 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 list goes on and on, I don't give a fuck, I'm still gonna do my thing and be here, I don't care if there's 20 people, I don't care if there's 500, I'm doing my thing. <laughs> I don't care what you say, if you talk shit, I'm still gonna be like ignoring what you say it's because I like doing what I do and that's it. People think I'm trans every day. People think that I'm pre-op, that I have a penis, blah, 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 blah. And I just am like, no, I asked, even asked my mom if I was born with a penis that was removed at birth and she said no and was like appalled and accosted and disgusted that I even asked her and that was because so many people kept fucking asking me. So, 
I don't know. It's just annoying. But that's the way it is. Like I've already I've already been through it all. There's nothing you could possibly say to me that hasn't already been fucking said, okay? It's already been said. And I've got it. and I s and I'm still here. So it is what it is. Just six ladders all jumbled together. What the fuck? <laughs> Oh, it's okay. Yeah, I don't listen to anybody. Obviously, I don't let it affect me or else I wouldn't, you know, be streaming still through despite it all. And you guys are just so nice to be here and support someone that's like so different and I gotta uh, have more cowbell. weird versus the regular rest of society. Manda Panda, thanks for following. Looks like we have another psycho that's gonna follow even though I'm like on a rampage right now. And going psycho, but that's a good sign because if you follow now, it's all gravy from here. <laughs> it's all good. Hey! No, no, no. Thank you. It, it's just like I just want to be like everyone else, where you have people that you get to talk to that you consider friends and that. You share your experiences with each other and your love for music and video games and just like creativity creativity and like characters and cosplay and makeup and giving and points. There's a lot to it. Only a ginger. <laughs> Fanny pants. Fanny pants. No, I didn't get asked to prom. Too weird. Too tall and too weird. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. <laughs> I hold my fist up. I'm like, whatever. What is? Because you know what? You guys keep me out of my pajamas and my isolation every day, so I really appreciate you being here. I was really isolated before because I'm homebound with multiple sclerosis, so. Wow, that stopped like right outside. Huh. And soon they're running their fingers through my ginger beard. And don't give my ginger nuts into their ginger tea, yeah. And asking, can they call me ginger? And I say, I don't think that's it's appropriate. It's only a ginger. Can call a not a ginger ginger. The power was out for just a few minutes. And all the ladies, they agree it's a fact. But once you got the love is real. Back. Only a ginger. Right? Little chirp boy. Aw, do you know? Slowly follows. Oh, don't say that, Album Pair. You don't know what other people's situation is. Maybe they got really lucky and they deserve it just as much as anybody. <laughs> this is actually a wig. It's Wig Out Wednesday. But with the G word is Thank you, Asher. Aw, thanks. I like this Tim Michelin um, Storm. I love the Tim Michelin Storm. I think that one's awesome. I wonder if my knife is hot enough to cut the warbler yet. Ginger minge. He's pretty talented, this guy, though, to be keeping coming up with stuff. Because I heard of him so long ago. How long do you have pink head? Just for today. Come tomorrow and I'll have my regular hair. And I'm going extra regular tomorrow, you guys, because 
someone was like, how did you get your hair Black Widow? Because it was curly and it was short. And I said, actually, my hair is naturally curly like that. And then I just pinned the part underneath, like the longer part underneath. And so tomorrow I'm going to do my hair curly, but like have it long and curly like it normally is. Because I straighten my hair every day. If I didn't straighten my hair every day, it's like, boom, boom. <laughs> it's like this big. It's out to here. I have out to here red hair. Flaming red hair. Curly, out to here kind of hair. Is that Kitty Mau Mau? Kitty Mau Mau's here! Kitty Mau Mau! Wishes he was a ninja. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can get this. Oh, it's finally working! It smells like burnt wood. I actually think that this compound is a plastic wood combined and the wood is what keeps it hard and then the plastic is part of the part that melts so easily so that you can put it into shape. Can you guys see that okay when I'm working on it? You can see it okay? That Mugen Scheiser, there she is! Can I borrow those tights for Halloween? <laughs> Aww, oh glory, thank you. You're so nice. Oh my gosh. And it's so weird, I get so confused too, like I don't know what to think. Because I... People are so opposite, they're like... I hear I'm ugly and then I hear I'm pretty and I'm just like, I don't know. <laughs> I just, as long as I feel like I'm comfortable with myself and I put my best face forward, I appreciate the compliments, but I think that it's all good. Also, I'm married, so I don't want you to get excited. <laughs> but I will be your friend till the end, and this is a channel where I have a feeling that we're all going to know each other for a long time. Don't you guys feel that? Like, I feel like all the people that are my regulars we're gonna be together like in this stream in this chat interacting for a really long time bear tooth please play minecraft no what is bear tooth okay apple and pear marvin marvin because mary can't take compliments i know i don't know it's like awkward like, I don't know how to, if I should accept it or if I need to tell them I'm married right away. Like, it's just awkward. Oh, a band. You guys need to help me. <laughs> Calm down, Rusty! I've never seen Rusty so animated. What's going on over there, Rusty? You're very excited about something. Right? I think so too. I think so too. You know, and I put I put forth effort and George is not the best complimenter. <laughs> the decent ass comment is more like it from him. So it does help me and my confidence to just be complimented sometimes. Or that I the outfit looks cool or you know that you could tell that I did my hair and my makeup at least. <laughs> it's okay, Rusty. Okay. I like animated Rusty. I think it's exciting. Woo! And he's getting excited about crew while hate breeders away. Oh shit! <laughs> shh, shh, shh. <laughs> hey babe, ass is looking decent today. <laughs> exactly. I am making an um an an bracer, and I just made the chest piece as you can see here with some more blend, some foam, and I'm cutting out the drought um bracer right now.
I gotta pee though, and I don't wanna. I don't wanna have to pee. Pain's really annoying for me. I have to pee like constantly. Constantly with the peeing! Just. <laughs> I'll be right back. Stay. Stay. No, I'm not going to take the camera with me to the bathroom. <laughs> In case you were wondering. Romance love triangle! He's just used to it. That could be it. Jerry, Jerry, Jerry. Jerry, Jerry. I get it. I got gotcha. you. custom computer? I have an Alienware machine. I think I'm okay for now, but next time we um, go to upgrade, maybe. See. I was worried about the unattended hot knife. That's why I was like, I gotta come back in here. No, we're okay. No problem. Oh, my girlfriend stopped screaming. Oh. Oh. Is that good or bad? I'm kind of confused, Cloud Sky. I'm like rereading that, like. Wait a minute, what? What's the problem with the girlfriends today? I'm not even looking that cute. Like, I'm not even like, I got like nothing going on here. <laughs> let me tell you something, or let me show you something. The girlfriends should not be jealous today. My boyfriend's a computer guy, so if he's, anyone's going to rebuild it, it's going to be him. But I really appreciate that offer for the help. The best way to help is, to, like, the stream is just to hang out in the channel and, like, keep the browser open when you're not actively here, just so that you count as a viewer. That's all that Twitch cares about. She's so jelly. <laughs> Whatever. And we're like a bunch of psychos in here. That's like the story of my life though. A lot of women. Like I can't be friends with women because women usually get jealous. And I can't be friends with guys because guys usually get all of them wanting like more than just friendship usually. Like in person I've found anyway. I have a hard time 
finding friends. And then everyone always assumes because you're you look a certain way that your life's all awesome, and then you're like, everyone hates you. Was <laughs> the reality? Doesn't make any sense. You have the same alienware, nice. Have you even played with jelly? Uh, what kind of jelly are you talking about, Willis? Oh, that didn't work out. If you don't get the right angle on the knife, it's can be scary. Milt, it milts weird. It has to be right on top of it and pressing down as you go. So it kind of makes it tricky a little bit. I'm married. Oh, thanks, um, um hey. I would love to meet someone from stream in real life. I don't have very many friends in real life that want to hang out with me or call me or talk to me. The ones that do, you'll see because they talk to me. It's Melissa and that's it, <laughs> pretty much. Only one that ever contacts me to do stuff. But it's very convenient. I just, I don't, I know my other friends are so busy that I don't want to bother them. And I'm so busy too, I don't know. I hope this is working. I'm probably gonna have to run over the design again one more time to get the warbler to break away all the way from it, but. Yeah, are you scared I'm gonna burn myself at this thing? <laughs> he doesn't build custom PCs. He builds PCs, but he also is a computer security guy and would want to build me my own computer if anyone was going to build it, just to make sure that everything's secure. I think so, maybe. Night shift. Maybe. I can never tell these days. I think everyone is. Everybody. <laughs> and then I get, and then I sound like a psychopath because I think everyone's a fucking Marvin. Everybody can't be a Marvin. I shouldn't just automatically assume Everyone hates me, but it's hard not to. I don't know. There's so many. Those 200, 5,000 hits that I have in my channel, more than half of those were trolls. So it's really hard sometimes <laughs> to just be so open that someone's not, you know, just assuming that they're not when, yeah. He works for FireEye. It's a computer security place. Thank you, yes I won. Invented <laughs> the PC, right? Mm-hmm. The basic. The um yeah it was Ethan. The uh, FireEye is the one that caught the hacking in China that was going on just recently. They were like responsible for catching all the people that are trying to hack into these big corporations. And they're the ones that are providing the security so that that doesn't happen again. They're detecting it and putting a stop to it, which is pretty cool. He gets to like be in it on some big like drama, hacking drama around the world. Hackers from, he gets to know about all the hackers from all over the world and what they're trying to do and what they're up to and how to stop them. It's pretty cool. He's like a he's like a cop. Ow. For internet security. Exciting. Top secret. Shh. <laughs> how long will be the stream? Oh my god, it's already four. Man. I'm not George is going to come home from the doctor. When he gets home from the doctor is probably when I'm going to stop streaming. I don't know if we'll get to get this um, bracer done today or not. I don't think we will.
It would work a lot better if I had a completely flat surface to cut this on, but I don't. So I'm just making do with the best I have here. And trying to stream it. Because I was cutting um, downstairs on the floor before, and it seemed to be working a little better than this little, this like fold out like tray table that I'm using as ghetto. Ghetto is fuck! It's okay. I did burn myself a little bit, but not bad. Oh my god! Big hugs, Astral! Um, he went, his appointment was at 3 o'clock, and it's like 4 right now, so he could be home anytime. 420. It's 420! 4.20! I'll see all you guys in like 10 minutes, once you're back from your smoke breaks, no. <laughs> Oh, that's a good idea to turn it upside down. And so I don't. Okay, let's turn it upside down. Perfect, Scotty. You're a genius. This is the song crew for you. This is the song I requested for your crew because it reminded me of him. I think it is anyway. Let me see. Yeah, it is. Crew, I, I heard this. And there was like this whole playlist of songs like this. It's pretty sweet. It's a trip hop playlist. 621 there. It gets more into the drum and bass here in a second. That's why it reminds me of you. So it's got like a lot of that drum and bass, like trippy awesomeness. Cowbell, baby. Lime JP, thanks so much for following. Yay. Appreciate that follow on a creative stream day. Indie pop. I think Cruz missing his song. See Cloud Sky, Tyler. Oh, you came back just in time. Oh, good. The one I requested after this one, too, is the next one for you. Way better, Scotty. Thank you. Working way better. Official bedroom trip. Sounds like your kind of song. Yeah, I think so too with the creative thing. Definitely. We also play a lot of video games, but every Wednesday we're doing the creative thing up in here if you're enjoying it. Right, Apex Twin? About sending a video. 
Um, like, anything under two minutes revolver that you want me to react to Wednesday streams when you come into the stream, I'll watch your video. It's gonna be like a cat video or like someone hurting themselves and then like, it needs to be funny but not gory or anything that's gonna get my Twitch banned, so. Eric, I am making a bracer and this is the chest piece out of Warple and Elternator foam that I'm working on for my drow. Dark Elf cosplay! Oh, damn it, Revolver! <laughs> I like it, yeah. We can, okay. And this one's like the bass. You probably have heard this one before. Bass head. Okay. Just break away these pieces here. And then we're gonna glue the foam. I don't think I need this anymore, so I'm gonna turn this deadly, deadly knife off before I burn myself again. Love the bass. Yeah, Battlefish, as long as it's not a song that's gonna have any racial slurs or profanity or anything like that's gonna get my Twitch band, you're welcome to request it. Nothing too trollish, you know. Bass head. head. Where is the phone that I cut out earlier here? What did I do with that? Where did I do it oh, it's right here. <laughs> I'm like, where the fuck is it? Hello. Can you replay to the tweet? Um, can you guys tell him what I just said, Revolver Enforcer? Because I don't, I can't reply to him right now. So there's this. It's gonna go like that. I'm gonna put this on the inside. This is just craft foam. It's not L200 foam this time because I want the bracer to be a little thinner. I don't want it to be so bulky on my arm. Thank you, Viper. You're so nice. And I can trim up these edges a little bit later on, so I'm not going to worry about that right now. We're just going to do the transition of gluing this onto this. It goes this way. I'm going to make sure I got it right. Okay. So we're going to take that paint gun and heat this up. Via Twitch or, you know, Twitter or Facebook message, you're welcome to say. Make sure it's nice and melted, warbler. And I'm just gonna kind of pause right there and then get this transferred over while it's still kind of hot. And I, I like, some people like to heat up the whole piece of Warbla and then transfer the foam and like put it, the foam on there. But I like to heat it up like a little bit by little bit because I'm very, I want it to be like right where I want it to be. And I noticed that because my hands are kind of like fumbly and stuff, I don't always glue it where I want it to go the first time and you can't mess up. You have to do, glue it right the first time or it doesn't, it doesn't work. Um, less than 10 minutes. It needs to be two, one to two minutes long. This is when it's good to have the rolling pin. I, got, I have two rolling pins. I have this one, I have this one, and I have this one. <laughs> Either one will work. Yeah, send me the short 
video and I'll watch it for you, just for you crew, but then everyone else is going to want me to watch their 10 minute long video as well, but that's okay. I'll still watch it for you. You are too OP. Oh no, you just need to sit. You could do that though, Revolver. Like he could do that if he wanted. Tell him he could do that if he wanted, but it's more about like whatever you want, people want me to watch and see my reaction to. Like if you've come across like a funny video during the week or a cute cat video you wanted to share with me and see what I my face looked like for the very first time I watched it. That's kind of the idea. That was Fantera's idea. That wasn't my idea on that one. The reaction video thing was Fantera's idea. And I thought it was a good idea. That's why we do it. Or we're trying it out anyway. It was only It's only been a couple weeks since we started doing the reaction videos on Wednesday. You don't want to start a trend. <laughs> you can send it privately and I'll watch it though. Yeah. Just not on the stream because it gets really redundant when it's that long. No matter what it is, it runs like, okay, next. <laughs> Have you guys seen that show right this minute? I want it to be like those kind of videos if you've seen that show. That's one of my favorite shows right this minute. Face head. Do you guys know Glitch Motion really did get that tattoo? He got a tattoo on his, I think it was his right or his left wrist that says Team Psycho on it. Can you believe that? Crew, I'll do it just for you. I'll tell people. You can only send me one 10 minute long video like once a year or something if they wanted to send me another one or something. What's up, Baron Brain? Oh no, it's a wig, Lewis. <laughs> wig out Wednesday. So on Wednesdays, I put a different color wig on, kind of take advantage of all the wigs that I have, and then um, make work on creative stuff as well. So here's the bracer mold that we made earlier. This is the same way I made the chest piece mold, bit, or the chest piece thing pattern that you see here. You take your saran wrap and you tape it, trace out your design, cut it out, cut the foam out, cut the warbler out, glue the foam to the warbler, which is the step we're on now, and then we're going to um, shape it. Oh, and I want people to send me the links not in chat because when you guys are linking it in chat all the time, it just makes it impossible for me to catch up with everything. That's why I want like a private message with the link. So, because then everyone's just trying to get me to look at everything. Oh, that's that D's Nuts guy. Oh, God. That's funny. I never knew who that was, though. Like, who the hell is this? Beetlejuice. He looks like the shrunken head guy from Beetlejuice a little bit. That guy does. Is that what you meant? Is that what you meant? Oh my god. That is funny. Okay, so now we're gonna heat up this whole piece of warbla and foam. Those teeth. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna try to move my pattern away because this pattern I wanna reuse for other things maybe. So we're heating the warbla and the foam back up together now because we're gonna put it over my arm and let it dry. This time I am going to heat up the whole piece of the warbla. I'm making an arm bracer. And we're going to heat up both sides. I gotta have more cowbell! J JDM, thank you so much for following. Oh, oh, yay! Follow train, pushing the cat. Thanks for following. Hell yes! Keep those follows coming for the creative stream. I do creative streams every day, so I'm on YouTube like Battlefield 4 and Grand Theft Auto. Hulkor, thank you for following. This is a Drow Dark Elf bracer that I need with the purple and the foam. 
I think this is pretty I gotta nice. have more cowbells! Are we getting raided? Live with JHR! Thank you so much for following! What is going on? 69! I gotta have more cowbells, baby! Thank you, Mahami, for following! Oh my god, what is going on? This is great! shape, maybe even squeeze it a little bit so that it has that, remember how I said I want these top pieces to kind of come in, oh, see, stick to each other, um, and then come up and out. That follow train was real. The follow train. I felt like I was getting raided for a minute there. Yay, feel really happy. I don't think it was a raid, I think it was just you know, like when you go into a restaurant and they could like have a, not have a rush like all day, but then like the second you get there, there's like 50 people that all came in. Maybe it was something like that. And you wanna just kinda keep shaping and holding this while it's drying and once it dries, it'll pretty much keep the same, the shape but I'm gonna also add some straps to it as well, um, just to make sure it stays on and everything. So now you guys get to, you got to see pretty much the whole process, like from start to finish with this bracer, with the pattern, the foam cut out, the foam trans, the warbler cut out, the foam transferring to the warbler, the shaping, or maybe, yeah, maybe the notifier stored them up. That's true, that could be it as well my view count didn't go up or anything. <laughs> Said sometimes too many times it's okay. See, I think this would also work really well, not only for cobwebs, but also like if you were going to do a dragon armor of some kind, this would be a good dragon bracer shape that you could use. You're in Germany. George is back, so I am going to call it right now, um, especially because we're just done with this part right now. I don't really have much more I can do with this. Um, I still am going to keep shaping it and holding it in place while it's, you know, drying, but it's pretty much just like that. And then I'll be adding in the details and the paint and the finish later on, but I won't have to work as much on this as I did the chest piece, so. I really appreciate you guys being here today. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I will be back tomorrow for crew day, and I'm definitely really excited for that. You know, it's one of my favorite days, even though we've been playing a lot of Grand Theft Auto lately. It's still one of them, my favorite days, so. There it is. George is here. So I am gonna go. And you'll have, you'll see straps in this, and it will be on my arm like that, with the rest of my outfit. It's gonna look like that one. Standing up. I know, I kind of got a lot done today. The other thing that I did today was we added the detailing to the front of the chest piece on the breast plate right here. I'm gonna have the lines that go for the spider webbing in there as well. And then I wanted to cut some pieces up top that are gonna be pointy like a, a cobweb as well, just like this. Like maybe even have it come up like that. Anyway. I will see you guys tomorrow. Lots of love. I'm going to see how George's doctor appointment went and everything. And I hope to see you guys back here tomorrow. Because, aw, <laughs> payday hype. Congrats. Thanks again, you guys. You're OP. I love you. And I will see you tomorrow. Oops, sorry. <laughs> I'm so unsmooth. I can't even say goodbye. <laughs>